Here we are. Martian and Manhunter. Yes. So this is the McFarland Multiverse DC, and it's pretty cool because it's Martian and Manhunter. Psychic powers, can go invisible, read minds, all that fancy stuff, and he can fly, and he can shapeshift. He's an ultimate badass. Here's some of the other guys in that little set. So let's get this guy open, see what this is all about. DC Rebirth is actually one of the comic book lines where they rebooted the entire DC right, I believe, after the crisis, crisis on Infinite Earths. So I could be wrong, but if I'm wrong, correct me. So, all right. So. There's our figure. Nice. Okay. Get back to him in a minute. All right. Let's see. I'm going to get this stuff out of there. Okay. Nice. All right. Just got a little stand there. Got this little card. Let's check out this card. Get that thing open there. All right. That right, Martian Manhunter. Nice little card. I notice there haven't been too many shiny cards. The Red Death card I have of that actually is shiny. So still, brand new card. Let's see. John Jones, the mysterious Martian Manhunter, is the one, the last survivors of the planet Mars, and was accidentally transported to Earth not long after the majority of his people were wiped out. Martian Manhunter is thought to be as strong as, or possibly stronger than Superman. I doubt that, but pretty close. Can run him for his money. And as a variety of powers, including super strength, super speed, flight, telepathy, uh, pretty much you can move stuff around, telekinesis, uh, shape shifting, shape shifting, regenerative abilities. I forgot about that. And near invulnerable. Um, Manhunter also has genuine level intellect and strong leadership skills using his vast powers and skills martian manhunter strives to protect the citizens of his own his home now which is planet earth not bad cool cool all right let's move that aside all right let's get this little stand out of there so all right that is a little stand out there got a little dc logo on it looks like there's dirt or something on it not cool all right, so let's move it aside. Here we go. Martian Manhunter. So he's got a couple little thingies in there. Let's go to cut out. One, two, and I guess three. That's all I'm seeing. So that's good, right? All right, let's go and pull him out of there. Let's go this feet first, I guess. I'm out of there. Pop. It's not crackle pop, right? There's another one. And his arm right there. Boom. Going back here. So he's got, he had multiples. So, all right. Now I believe we have them. Now let's get him out of there. So fortunately, this figure doesn't come with extra stuff. So that Martian Manhunter doesn't need all that stuff. Come on, shape shifting. So he's got a pretty solid, really thick cape. So looks like it just pops in there. You can pop it out. Careful with that. So he's got his little straps going on here. They're loose too. Got his little part of the cape here. Almost looks like a like a leather shield going on. Got his little head going on. He was pretty good up and down. He's it's actually really loose. You can move him real good, but he also stays. So yeah, he feels very posable, like very good. Some of these figures I pick up, they like 
fall fall apart and stuff. Not fun. So, yes, that's our boy Martian Manhunter. So let's put him on his little little stand there. Let's see, sometimes I have trouble with these stands too. He's a very simple toy. Like I said, he doesn't come with much. Very simple. But I have never had a Martian Manhunter to my collection. So I'll stand now. Stand him up. Yeah. Let me, uh, let me readjust this camera real quick so we get better. Yeah, there he goes. His head, you can kind of move up and down a little bit. Not much, though, but... Yeah, it's not much to him to pose. You can make him like in a battle scene, getting ready to go. Now, if he had like an axe or something, that'd be cool. But, you know, he doesn't need weapons. He is a weapon. So, the stand doesn't want to stand. So, I'll try, to, try to put it in there again. A little more pressure this time. So, yeah. Yes. Yes, we can work with that. Yeah. Yeah. But you can pose them pretty good. Come up with some some kind of clever thing. But like I said, sucks doesn't come with anything. I'm so I'm so spoiled with Batman because all the Batman toys come with something new, something shiny. So you can always just throw a sword or something on them. But yeah, this hand's a solid fist. This one actually is made to hold something. So I'm gonna pretend. But yeah, he's he's ready for battle. Anyways, Martian Manhunter. So. And his, of course, his little card. So, not much to it. So, yep. McFarland's toy line, Martian Manhunter, DC Rebirth. Till next time, kitties. Till next time. Hope you enjoyed.